you can see the left eye is also the left eyelids there is some rubbing as you can see redness along the eyelids as compared to the right eye and uh, there's something irritating the hamster on the left side as compared to the right side now on the right side you can see that uh, the eyes is wide open and there's no uh, hair loss around the eyelids now you compare to the left, left eye and uh, you can see around the eyelids there is redness and hair loss due to rubbing and uh, so we need to check the ears as well ears and eye because there's something irritating now there's a swelling below the eye, the left eye in fact the left eye is half closed compared to the right eye which is uh, normally a normal size and uh, open so many things needs observation rather than uh, instant diagnosis as in this case now as vets we don't have really the time to to uh, observe small dwarf hamsters but uh, since this hamster is hospitalized overnight I have the chance to to observe especially now that he is eating and uh, does not move about now you can see the asymmetrical size below the the nose or beside the nose on the left side of the nose between the nose and the eye there's a swelling as compared to the the right side right side there's no swelling so it's quite the eye eyeball is quite big uh, this is through the glass so it's not so uh, clear but you can see symmetrically there's something wrong with the left side the owner is the owner knows about it too and has told me that uh, this hamster is uh, not eating much despite the medication given by the vet one four days ago but it's quite active and uh, so only under anesthesia will we know will we know whether there's abscess or something stuck in the cheek pouch March 17, 2014 Top Ayer Vets 10.30am I will put the hamster under anesthesia later and check thoroughly the ears the left ear and the and the cheek pouch now in dogs you will see similar things when they rub the eyes the hair the hair around the eyes are rubbed off the hair, hairs around the eyelids are rubbed off and you can see a ring of hairless ring when you compare the left eye to the right eye right eye, you, you still have the hair so the right eye you can see there is no ring of hair loss around the eyelids you can still see the hairs around the eyelids so that, that is the difference now the hamster is actually eating and uh, this is good and uh, the only thing is he's not putting on weight and that's why the owner is worried yeah. you can tell whether the hamster has a good appetite by looking at the first two pellets in this case there were only one or two so this shows that he's not really eating much or not eating sufficiently
now he's grooming himself. lens can focus better if it's not done through the glass. It was done through the glass just now, so it was difficult to focus. So soon you'll be under anesthesia to check the left ear and the and the cheek pouch on the left side. Top by your vets Monday March 17 2014 about 10 a.m. You can see the hamster can drink as well. You have to put the level a bit higher in this case. Yeah. Just now it was too low. Now you can see clearly now the left eye. You can see the rubbing of the left eye. You can see the hair around the eyelids are rot board and uh, there's a swelling below the left eye nearer to the lower part you can see here and uh, they can compare to the other eye now the other eye would be you see no, no hair loss around the eyelids and uh, so for such small creatures as dwarf hamsters, one need to be observant to check. Top of your vets, March 17, 2014.